but just recently they've been a bit of a mixed bag of uh, results so that's got them really back on track and I think they go to Leeds next in, uh, wow, in midweek so that's another biggie what about Southampton because you just touched on it there of course they, they beat West Ham in the FA Cup didn't they midweek we see Southampton at both ends of the spectrum and it's strange we never we don't quite see maybe the consistency maybe that's that kind of a club you know you have those kind of a clubs where the pressure is you know in a big clubs you are always under pressure you have to win because you're always supposed to win you are fighting for titles because i agree with you it happened to southampton very often no matter who the manager is with kuman with puel with the spanish guy with with now with ralph all of them are top managers, of course. But it happens, you know, they have a bad spell, then they have a good spell, and when you think, yeah, now they're going to continue that good spell, maybe they, they, they get satisfied. Maybe they drop that 5%, as I was mm-hmm. saying, and you don't have to do it deliberately, but you are not burning. You're not burning anymore before. We are safe, we are okay. We won five on a row. We can afford a defeat. Yeah. And in a big club, you can't do it. No, and in a big league, you have no chance if you do it. <laughs> yeah, 